of the most important lessons I've learned about speaking comes from my friend and mentor Darren LaCroix. Darren points out that in every audience there are people who are sitting in front of us who need what we have to say. Now often they're hiding behind smiles and they're nodding their heads but that's hiding pain inside and what we can provide them more than anything else is hope. No matter what your topic I give people hope that uh, they can become better speakers and presenters and, and create confidence and have more impact. Other people talk about uh, providing hope for health and, and still others, like in my old world of financial planning, hope that they can have a comfortable retirement. No matter what your topic, the ultimate benefit you give them is hope. And as Darren points out, we don't know what they're thinking. We, we certainly don't know what they're feeling because often they're putting on their public face. One of the toughest facts I had to accept about public speaking is that we will almost never know the impact that we've had on audiences. Now we may get kudos when we come off stage and people might say, hey, that was a great job, or we might get some positive evaluations. But the harsh reality is we're not going to know how we truly touch people's hearts in almost all cases. So with that in mind, you have to go on faith and trust that as a speaker, you're providing a benefit to people. So if you ever hit a rough patch as a speaker and you're wondering, is this worth the practice and the rehearsal because I'm not getting any feedback, know this. Most of the time you won't. But the message you have is impactful and you are touching lives and you're giving people that one thing that they need more than any other when times are dark and they feel like life is just too tough. You're giving them hope. Keep speaking, and we'll see you tomorrow in our daily dose of public speaking wisdom.